Hello friends, I'm Akash, and a hearty welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to learn a simple subtraction trick to subtract any number from a round number. Let's take a look at the first example of this trick. 4000 minus 2458. The first step is to split the number 2458 into two parts. The first part consists of the first digit, and the rest is the second part. Let's take a look at the first part of 2458, which is 2. Now you must add 1 to this part, and then subtract it from 4, which is the first part of the other number. So in this case, 2 plus 1 is 3, and then 4 minus 3 is 1. Therefore, the first part of the answer is 1. Let's take a look at the remaining part, which is 4, 5, 8. This one follows a strategy known as all from 9, last from 10. This means you have to subtract each digit from 9, except the last one, which is subtracted from 10. This means that we have to subtract 4 from 9, so that means 9 minus 4, which is 5, and then 9 minus 5, which is 4, and then because 8 is the last digit, we must subtract it from 10, which means 10 minus 8 is 2. And that is your answer, 1,542. Let's take a look at our next problem, 16,000 minus 8,217. Again, the first part of this problem is to split the number 8,217 into two parts. The first part consists of the first digit, 8, and the rest is the 217, which is the second part. Let's take a look at the first part. Again, the strategy is to add 1 to this part of the number and then subtract it from the other part. In this case, we're looking at 8 plus 1, which is 9, and then we have to subtract this from the part of the other number, which is 16. 16 minus 9 is equal to 7, and that is the first part of the answer. The second part of the answer is formed with the same trick, all from 9, last from 10. In this case, what this means is we have to subtract each digit of the number 217 from 9, accepting the last one, which should be subtracted from 10. So this means we have 9 minus 2, which is 7, 9 minus 1, which is 8, and then, because 7 is the last digit, we have 10 minus 7, which is 3. Therefore, 16,000 minus 8,217 is equal to 7,783. And that is the answer. Let's take a look at our final problem. 57,000 minus 34,526. This one might look a little bit more complicated because both numbers are five digit, but it works the same way. Again, the first part of the answer is to split the number 34,526 into two parts. But instead of the first part being one digit, we're going to make that part two digits. As we look at the first part, 34, add 1, and then subtract that from the first part of the other number. This means we have 34 plus 1, which is 35, and then we subtract it from 57. So 57 minus 35, which is 22. Now let's take a look at the other part of this number, 526. All from 9, and the last from 10. So, doing the same thing that we did with the other numbers, we have 9 minus 5, which is 4, 9 minus 2, which is 7, and 10 minus 6, which is 4. This means that 57,000 minus 34,526 is equal to 22,474, and that is the answer. Now that you know how to do this simple subtraction trick, it's time for your homework. Try to figure out what 5,000 minus 3,144 is, what 14,000 minus 9,567 is, and what 84,000 minus 75,946 is. 
Make sure to comment all your answers in the comment section below, and for your convenience, the correct answers to these questions will be in the description below. Thanks so much for watching. If you like my videos, then make sure to subscribe so you don't miss another one of my YouTube videos ever again. Once again, thanks so much for watching. Love you. Akash.